did you know, he was bad But it's the truth for him, you don't get these yeah. things in a hurry. Well, the ceremony going to take place, Pete. It's um. Turn this way. Turn this way. Turn this way. Save cheese. Cheese. Come, Marie. No. Look at this. We're going on today. Hello. Say hello. Say hello, Marie. Here, hug my face. Hello. I will need to walk up. <laughs> oh yeah, how are you Patricia? And Marie. Oh yeah, oh, it's so nice to have Oh yeah. Oh. Hey, Johnny. Thank you. 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 Thank Look at the pilot's license, Jack. Yeah. Do you have to keep doing it on today now? He's not saying it. Do you have to keep doing it on today now? He's not saying it. You shouldn't be doing that. Don't you? I need to turn the car. Thank you. 
Afalcharo Hagar TDs and local councillors and Deputy Indy Kenny sends his apologies for not being able to be with us today. Afalcharo to Kigala and Shah in Akilam. August Cotton, Nihon McGarry, Vice President of the INTO, apologies that he cannot be with us here today as he's in hospital in Dublin. Tafalcharot Akunrahor, we pay a special welcome to Mr. Tom Gill here behind me from Galway, who is the contractor. And I think I can guarantee him a very hospital wel hospitable welcome here in Mayo, and that we'll all be very, very generous to him in his stay here. Whether that generosity can extend to the vicinities of Mikhail Park in mid-July, I cannot guarantee. I hope not. <laughs> Today is a very, very special occasion for all of us, and I must pay tribute to all of you who have worked very, very hard to get this new school. I could go on and say a lot, but we'll keep our words short today and we wait for another day. But yes, I think we can't let the occasion pass without being tribute to all those who have worked so hard, travelled on long deputations, spoke, pressed our case with the media, both locally and nationally, all through the years. And I think your hard work has been rewarded here today. And I think you deserve to give yourself a good bull of us for what you have done. <laughs> Finally, may I thank the press, both locally and nationally. Some of them are who are here today, some of them who can't be with us today, who have highlighted our plight over the last number of years. And we are indebted to them for what they have done for us. Which, which is ultimately us being here today and Commissioner Flynn turning the first start for us. So we leave the talking at that for this occasion and I'll ask Father Gleeson and Father Siri to bless the site for us there with them. We ask God to bless all of them and to bless this site. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the I never mentioned the chairman of the Mayo County Council who's here behind me, Sean McAvoy. Thar broad arm, Sean. Thar broad arm, Sean. Now, Commissioner Flynn, you might kindly take that spade in your hands and show us if you are able to work such a thing. <laughs> I got him. I got him. <laughs> He's going to show me what he can do to spade first, and then he'll have a few words. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
of you yourselves and the way you set about getting the job done and I know all about that. <laughs> and if there's going to be any prize given today, it's going to be for perseverance and persistence. And thankfully now, he cannot contact me as readily every day because I'm the other side of the world. <laughs> and that's Antusilo Mackie, who has served this community well as your principal and as your man of action. Well done. And of course, this is a primary school location and primary education is so important. 
primary school is where you learn all the skills to put control into your life. At home, of course, is the first place of education, and that's where children learn to learn. That's where they learn how to learn first. And it's at the national school, that's the place which is so vital in the pre-teen years, where children learn the importance of learning. And it's at the national school too, that you learn all the songs that harmonize in your head 50 years from then on. And that's where you develop the passion too for the football teams and the sports that last you a lifetime. And that's where you start to read the books that bring the other times and the other places everywhere in the world home to you. So what we're talking about today is a vote of confidence in the future here in Kilawala. Because, you know, school, of course, and this school, this new school is more than just a building. It's the guardian of continuity for the community of Kilawala. It's the guardian for the traditions, the culture, and the values. And all of those things are under such pressures here in Ireland and around the world today. So it was never intended, you know, that the community or the European community or any community would be a means to homogenize the lives of people into a sameness. It was always a question of diversity. And that's the great potential that we have here in Ireland. And that's what we are going to witness here in the coming years in this magnificent new building. And as they say, there's one last thing I'd like to say. This new venture, this new building and this new school will enrich a little part of this earth. And that's what we're doing here today.
Stand with the man, stand with your head on the other side. Come here, What about this? This will be for history anyway. Yes, let's do it. What I need now, Miri gets it. Perfect. Well done. Good to see you.
That's right, no. Oh, you get him, buddy. Cover him, buddy. Oh, <laughs> 